I've yes. never seen anything like it. Yes, right now there's only 20 in the world. Here in Munich, Germany, I've flown over to film some epic BMWs, including this one. This is a one-off BMW and it's got stickers all over it. Hello. Hey, uh, yeah, I mean, this one's really cool, but I want to show you another BMW. Sergi, I'm quick. doing it. I know, I know, I know. But look, you guys want to see a good video and a good car. And I know that you always do supercars, but I have a really special Sergi, video. Sergi, you're literally hiding. Okay, come here, come here, come here, come here. Come on. Whose channel is this? I promise, I promise you're going to like it. Come, come. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. look. All right, so we'll get car, back to that one this then, car I suppose. Looks cool. Yeah. But look at that. That one right there. What do you think? Look. That's literally why this, you interrupted this is the my car. video. This is like the definition of don't judge a book by its cover. Okay. Even if the cover says urban suite, so you kind of know that something's it's up. It's an I3. Like, it's yeah. cool. Like, yeah. Yeah. But it has a number nine. So why does this have a number nine in it? It's numbered. That means it's got to be special. Oh, okay. Yeah. You've got a point okay. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Other hint, urban yeah. suite? Yeah. Yeah. So. This, okay. So it's number nine out of how many? 20. Oh, 20? Yeah, this this is a pretty big deal. Oh, damn. So we're yeah. looking at a million dollar car here. Is it? Potentially. We can't disclose <laughs> the price yet. Okay, okay. But. Yeah, what's. Well, yeah, why? To blow your mind. Yeah. Does that look, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Does that look like a chair to you? No. No, that's not a chair. Because this is your boutique hotel wow. on wheels. Oh, what? Yeah. Huh? What? I know, right? Is this a real car? Is I know. This... When they opened the doors, I was like, oh my god, I have to show Alex. What? Like, even if I have to interrupt the other This shoot. is like so like a me car to review. Yes. Oh my god. How, and, what? And look, the best thing is, you want to hop in here? Yeah, okay. Yeah, hop in. So yeah. this is like a mini chauffeur driven car. I've yes. never seen anything like it. Yes. Right now, there's only 20 in the world. What? But you have three buttons here. Yeah. One second. Press this one. This one? Yep. Okay. Oh, what? Is this for my feet? That's for your feet. Oh. Your shoes are pretty new, so I think that is not gonna make it dirty. You're kidding okay. me. Yep, and then you have another triangle over there. This one? Yep. Oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> Do you feel like a total that boss right so now? Good. How cool is this? It's like. Oh my god, I never knew. I never knew. This is epic, Sergi. Yeah, what? You, would, you would never think that you'd find this inside of an i3. Now on the lamp, you're, you're going to see that here, there's a little laser thing. Yeah. Put your finger on top of the laser thing. <gasps> Ta -da. Yeah. So the whole concept, the whole idea was to make this into a boutique hotel. I think they did a pretty solid job I because think this is a brilliant idea. I know I do too. I didn't realize like you could get such a small car that make it like into a comfy like chauffeur. Yes. But there's one feature okay. that I want to show you. That I oh, think wait, look at this. Cooler. Look at this. This is a coat hanger on the back of the headrest. So you can literally just hang your coat here. They've thought of everything. Yep. That is so cool. The so, coat hanger, right? The coat hanger is cool too. That's cool. Like you can actually put your coat here. You want to test it out? Yeah. Let's see. Look. So, I mean, you have everything that you would want to have. You know? That is so that. cool. Easy. Uh, but down here, yeah. you have an iPad because you can connect whatever you want to here. Uh huh. iPad, I'm going to press play. Mm hmm. And listen where the sound's coming from. From your headrest. Oh, what? I didn't know it's an i3 what? sounded like this. Yeah. <laughs> this is, so I'm watching one of my videos here. It's yeah. got, wow, this sound is epic. I know, right? Supercar blonde here it's in meant to Germany. be your I've own. I've got something really special to show you. <laughs> this is kind of like here. That's you know what this is? crazy. It's your own little bubble. So when you're being driven around, you can just listen and watch your own. Oh, Stuff. my own show. That's what yeah. I do in all my spare time. I just watch myself on TV. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy, Serge. No yeah. way. Right. So is this like actually going into production? Like, is this something you can buy? Yeah. So right now they're waiting to see how much demand they get on it. But potentially, yes. I would totally get one yeah. of these. Look, we have kind of the inside scoop, but around five. If they get about 500 to 1000 requests, yeah. they might make this commercial. For the public we can make that happen for sure i mean i'm just saying go put your comment <laughs> down underneath this video and uh let's get bmw to make this we can actually yeah. the supercar blondie family can literally make this happen make this happen yeah. yeah they should rename it to the i3 supercar blondie what do you guys think if we make this happen then yeah i'm gonna make them put my logo on the car yeah <laughs> okay yeah you have your own little remote like this yeah um we've already 
kind of press play and all that stuff so we can bring this back like that Pop. oh okay yeah and here and you then... have your own obviously heated or cooled Oh, nice. Cup holders. Oh, the normal i3 doesn't look like this, obviously. No. This is just a sweet version of the i3. Right, but it's still, obviously it's still electric, right? The start stop is over here. Yep. And you have this huge kind of like, oh. I don't know what to call it, but that's basically the gears. You oh, can right. do neutral, reverse. So how you meant, you probably meant to hold it like this, no? Or yes. what's the thumb, that, yeah. Yeah, okay. it's interesting though, I haven't seen it like that. Like press. a little floating dash. Yep. And this is cool too, the floating screen in the middle. Like yep. this is full. Yeah. Actually, all of this is interesting because it's completely open, even yeah, on the bottom true. part. Yeah, true. Let me move that back a little bit so you can see. Yeah. There's a lot you of space. You could actually potentially even put your dogs here. Oh my god. Imagine uh, Peppy and Ruby hanging around. Sold! <laughs> if you take a look at this material, you can already tell that. Uh, yeah, that's it's a very different, unique. isn't it? 80% of the material in this car is made from recyclable oh. material. So this so wood as well would be sustainable yes. wood? It's meant to be a sustainable kind of vision of the future of wow. transport. I love it. And I think it's really luxurious to be honest. I'm super, um, like I tell you, I'm super comfortable back here. Yeah. I totally get that this is like a business person's chauffeur driven car. Yeah. The only thing missing for me is like a little laptop stand. Yes. Because if you're wanting to be working in the back, you need somewhere to put your laptop. Right. That was actually the interesting thing as well, because when I first saw this table, I was like, oh, well, that's where you put your laptop, but no one's going to be working no, like no, this. No, exactly. I think this is meant to more just disconnect yeah, and okay. kind of relax. So the normal or standard i3, BMW i3 costs about $45,000. So if this were to go into production... Uh, how much more yeah. would you pay? I, this I, is... I tried to squeeze that information out of uh, a BMW official. He wouldn't tell me. He said it wouldn't be that that much expensive. More. Oh yeah. Like it, like considering the luxury car world, yeah. it wouldn't be that much more expensive. But obviously, we'd be more than the forty five thousand. Like if you think about it, if you want to be chauffeur driven around the city, there are only like a few uh, four seater. Lug super luxurious cars that you can buy to do that and they're all quite expensive yes whereas if it's just you on the road every day going to and from work and you want to be driven around you could buy something like this still be in luxury yeah. and yet not have to buy like a full-on luxurious four-door sedan with everything else yeah. this actually makes total sense yeah. to me it's cool what I do mean... you guys think are you a fan I am. I, I, I didn't know that. Okay, that was definitely worth the interruption. All right, yeah. I'm going to go show you guys this car now on another video. Right. Um, but that was definitely so worth it. I'm not getting fired then, right? It was worth the interruption. <laughs> it was <Sorry>. worth it. <laughs> You're still hired. Awesome. All right, guys, what do you reckon? Go chuck your comments in the comments section and subscribe to the Supercar Blondie channel. Thank you very much to Sergi as well. Absolutely. That was awesome. Well, who's going to get the chauffeur now around? We're not allowed to drive it. Oh. But we can't be chauffeured in it. Okay. So who wants to be chauffeured in it? Let's rock, paper, scissors. Okay, in Australia they do one, two. And then no. reveal. Okay. One, rock, two. Oh, sorry, no, sorry. It's rock, no, paper, no, no, scissors, no. shoot. Oh my God. The rock, it's... paper, scissors, reveal. Yes. Okay. Re no, we say shoot, but reveal also okay. works. Whatever. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot, reveal. And that's a rookie move. You never do scissors first on a rock, paper, scissors because everyone always does it. That's Damn. why. You want the rock. <laughs> okay, <laughs> you're, you're in, Shepard. I'm out. I've been booted out. All right, guys, I think we're out. Love y'all! I'm living the dream! This is great! <laughs>